Hello and welcome. If you like today's video, please like and subscribe. It really helps. So before I begin, I just want to say I'm very tired. I've just got in and I'm in the process of moving my office space, re rebuilding it um, because I've been getting pains in my legs with uh, being sat down at my current workstation. So I'm rebuilding that and then I will crack on with the tutorials. Today, I want to expand upon root motion retargeting. In my tutorials, I missed quite a lot because just like you, I was learning as I went along and I, I missed all the full body IK stuff uh, and root motion and, and etc. But there is a new third person template out with Unreal Engine 5, the latest builds, and there is uh, examples of retargeting in there and so I've been studying those as well and those have made it I understand it slightly better I still think there's more to come so I can't wait for the documentation but today we're going to as I said we're going to deal with the root motion problem now videos have already appeared forum posts telling you how to do the root motion but I've also found other things so I want to put them all into this one video and then um, hopefully it'll help you out so if you're having the root motion problem what I mean by that is let me just go to my screen okay so if we go to the skeleton tree and select root as you can see in this animation there is root motion and the root is moving look and if we click on pelvis the pelvis is moving with the root Okay. First, click up here, make sure show retargeting options is selected and make sure root it has either animation or animation scaled. Um, next, go to asset details of your animation, type in root and ensure that force root lock here is not selected. Make sure it is unchecked and hit save. Now, your IK rigs, this is, I didn't include this in my tutorials, but I'm now advising you to do it. Create a root chain for the just the root bone like so then select it in your IK retargeter come up here in the details panel go to translation mode and ensure that globally scaled is selected and then that is it so in your animation make sure force root lock is not checked in your ik rigs for both source and target create a root chain in your ik retargeter select the root chain go to translation mode and set to globally scaled now if we go to our running animation and I retarget characters experimental and we click on it we should now have root motion and the pelvis should move with the root and that's it so if you've been having that problem that's how you fix it um, I think that's it for today as I said I've got more tutorials on the way I've got quite a few lined up I've been doing quite a lot of research and development ready to teach you some things that I don't think other people are teaching and that has been taking quite a lot of time because obviously I have to learn before I can teach and uh, yeah okay so I think I'm gonna leave this here because I really need to go to bed I'm so tired <laughs> 
Um, if you like this video, please like and subscribe and tutorials are on the way. Thanks for watching.